Hey ladies, so I'm back with another wig revamp. <laughs> if you haven't been able to tell up until now, obviously I just cannot keep a wig and keep it in its original state. I always have to do something to it or change it up. I just, I get tired of one look, but for so long. So I decided that I was gonna go ahead and cut this unit. This is the Sensational um, Custom Wig Cap Unit. I'll put the exact name of it on the screen here because obviously I'm butchering it. But yeah, I decided that I wanted to cut it. I wanted a really blunt cut on the wig. So as you can see, I put the hair ties on it so that way I can get it the same length on both sides. Um, and sorry, when I leaned forward to make sure the hair wasn't getting all over me, I went out of frame. But basically I just cut the hair below the hair tie because I wanted to make sure that I was getting as even of a cut as possible. And I'm doing the same thing on the other side. And as you can see with the excess hair, I'm just clipping it with a hair clip so that way I don't have hair all over the place. And then once I took the hair ties off, it's just a very blunt cut. As you can see, it's pretty much even. I could go through and even it up some more with some scissors if I wanted to, but since I plan on bumping the ends of this wig anyway, it's not really gonna make a difference. You're not gonna be able to really tell that it's not perfectly, perfectly, perfectly cut. Like, I'm not a hairdresser, so I wasn't about to be pressed to do all of that. So then as you can see here on one side, I already bumped it and I basically bumped the hair in two directions going under and then like doing a flip up type of bump um, just because I wanted the bottom to be really full. And so I basically cut this wig because I was looking for a new wig and I really wanted something that was of a medium length but a blunt cut and I just could not find what I was looking for and so at first I was going to just buy another one of this sensational wig and then cut that one but I was like you know what I might as well just cut the one I have it's long enough that at the length I wanted when I cut it I knew that I would get those blunt ends because it really didn't have any layers in it so I knew that I would be able to achieve what I wanted and basically I'm going to insert pictures here but I had come across a couple of different pictures on Instagram and then um, one of the YouTubers I want to say her name is pretty Collins 11 or something like that I will put her name on here as well she had reviewed a couple of wigs and I really like them but the wigs are between 150 and 200 dollars and I'm just not personally spending that kind of money on a single unit right now so I was like you know what I can just kind of remix one of the things I have and that's what I did so basically, I'm gonna shut up now. <laughs> the rest of the video is just me bumping the ends. And I didn't do anything to my part in this video just because I was on to the next thing after doing this. But I will insert pictures where you can see with the part, with the concealer and the foundation in it and whatnot, and just what it looked like um, as I wear it, wore it, excuse me, a couple of different days. So anyway, I'll go ahead and go. Thanks for checking out my video and please rate, comment, and subscribe. Um, and yeah, I will see you ladies soon. Bye.